Local coverage you can count on continues with Glenn Marini's Sports Report, Indiana's Sportscaster of the Year. When it comes to the high school track and field season, we are hitting the home stretch, and the Angola Hornets girls team is creating a lot of buzz. Last Friday, Angola edging West Noble by five and a half points for the NECC title. The Hornets not only clinching a three-peat, but also their sixth conference crown in the last eight years. And with that, we're proud to present Angola Girls Track as your Optimum Performance Sports Team of the Week. I'm Dr. Ian Nelson of Fort Wayne Orthopedics here at the new Ops North facility congratulating this week's Team of the Week. Congratulations, you are the new standard. We are here at the Hornet's Nest, where Angola is still buzzing after their third straight NECC title on the girls' side. And we've got one of the head uh, track and field coaches, Troy Smith. He handles everything with the girls. Coach, this meet came down to the wire. When you won that 4x400 meet and clinched that third straight conference crown, what was going through your mind? Uh, we were just really proud for the girls. They put in a lot of work over the last three years, and they've really battled, and it's a young group. They're experienced. And uh, I was really happy for all the coaches. You know, we got Michelle Davis, who's one of the best distance coaches in the area, and Coach McHugh, who's done a great job with the vault and the jump. And we've picked up uh, three or four new coaches who've really done a great job as well. So all the athletes and all the coaches, I was just happy for all of them to see them have that level of success. We knew conference was really good. You know, West Noble and Fairfield and Cherubusco, they're so, they're so well coached and they have so many great athletes. We knew we were going to have to win with depth this year. Well, Angola's got another conference championship in their bag, and to signify that, we've got an old-fashioned bag race, a 20-yard dash, featuring a few of the standouts from this year's Angola girls track team. You're going to hop 20 yards from the goal line to the 20-yard line. On your mark, get set, go! Oh, this is neck and neck, neck and neck. We got our winner! What was going through your mind when you realized you clinched another conference crown? I mean, it was just amazing, like all the hard work that all the girls put into. It was just so rewarding. Really just, everybody's different and we all, at the end of the day, just come together and we all were very good with teamwork and just supporting one another and it really shows at the end of the day. It was like definitely a team effort. Every little point mattered, especially like on the throwing side, they picked up a couple of really important points for us. So that was cool to see it all come together. I just think we're all like best friends. We're always doing stuff together and we're always having a lot of fun at practice and it just makes it a really good team to be on. Congrats to Angola Girls Track. They are your OPS Team of the Week.